Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve the Xbox One error code 0x800C0008 that you are experiencing on your Xbox app on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer that says it encountered an error and something went wrong. Try again later. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So what I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu and type in apps and features. Best match, come back with apps and features. Go ahead and open that up. In the apps list, go ahead and just type in Xbox. When the best matches should come back with Xbox, go ahead and click the three dotted icon next to it and select advanced options. Scroll down. Underneath reset, if the app isn't working right, we can try and repair it. If the app's data won't be affected, select the repair button. And then once you know what that, close out of here and restart your device. And then once you're done with that, hopefully that has resolved the problem. If you're still experiencing an issue, we can try to reset the application. So make sure everything's backed up, which it should be. We're just resetting the Windows application of Xbox here anyway. But we're going to go back into the search menu and type in apps and features. Go ahead and open that up once again. And you want to search the field. I accidentally clicked on something else. I had to click the little back arrow. But anyway, going back to the apps list, it's going to go ahead and search for Xbox again. Select the three dotted icon next to it, and then select Advanced Options. Scroll down on the right side, and then underneath Reset. If the app still isn't working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. Select Reset. This will permanently delete the app's data on this device, including your preferences and sign-in details. Select Reset. And then once that's done again, like we did with the first one, go ahead and restart your computer. And now hopefully your issue should have been resolved. So as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do a positive to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.